We take a look at the tail and tape for this one in the featherweight division. Hakeem Nawadu, 23 years of age, 5'8". There you see his weight and reach. Mike Malott, 22 years of age, stands 6 feet 1 inches tall, slight bit heavier, and 3 inch reach advantage. We now go inside the cage. That is where Jazz Seguro has the official introduction. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is brought to you by the Green Beret Foundation. Three rounds in the World Series of Fighting Featherweight Division. A couple of undefeated records. Somebody's O has got to go. And now, introducing on the blue side, his record, four wins, zero defeats, undefeated. He stands six feet and one inch tall, weighing in at 147 and one half pounds, fighting out of Waterdown, Ontario. Tonight, he makes his debut in the World Series of Fighting, introducing the main attraction, Mike Malott. And now his opponent across the decagon on the red side, also undefeated with two victories and no losses. Standing five feet, eight inches tall, weighing in at 146 pounds, fighting out of Calgary, Alberta, presenting Mean Hakeem Dawadu. Your third man in the cage is John Brack. So we are set to go in the featherweight division. Hakeem Duwadu and Mike Malad as Megan Stack gets things started here in Edmonton. And she looks You're have to open that better again. than I have. Got it. Good. Oh, this is uh, this is going to be a fight. Look at it. All right, fighter, you ready? You ready? Fight. Oh. Scheduled for three, boss. What's Spinning the overrunner to this one going the distance? Mullet's going to throw a spinning back. Made that movement. I don't know why. Let's see if that happens. like the cricket player. And now, he's just a whisper. Just does a sport work in the sport, does it? <laughs> no. I did a show one time, and uh, my partner talked like that. I go, pick it up. Well, that was a very nice high kick. And boss, it looks like these guys both respect one another's speed. Yeah. So the, the feeling out period has begun here in round number one for the 145 pounders. Well, they know they can't be knocked out. You make one mistake, and one of these punches lands. These guys are probably great strikers, and now they suddenly have what, six ounce gloves. That's a whole different ball game now. We got that close, Phil. Sit up the center. Real wide. Upset the tiger. The water was connected there with the big shot. And he was dazed, you could tell his feet. Setting it up very nicely, start throwing straight to the body. Let him get used to that. And he's gonna probably do it again and add a straight to the head. Wow! so far, but as a great boss room pointed out, these guys strike very quick. They've got power on the hands. This thing could be over if one of these combinations hits the right spot. The one who comes over the top that time. I love that. Uh, right Good combination coming from a lot. Boss if you're going to come in with one, you might as well come with a combo. You might as well do it. Yeah, but his feet were a little bit off to the side. If you put the ball to the attempt. Big throw from a lot. That's what I told you. She she takes the back and victories. Look at this, boss. Takes the back and the tail. The water are doing a great job dropping that chin. Watch him sink it in. Protect your neck. Protect your neck. Protect your neck, Akeem. Watch your throw. Watch your throw. He's got a beautiful leg. So the boss will just bounce. No, that's sometimes a dangerous thing. You know, because you 
you might open your neck. Take your time. You might yeah, 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 that's right. You're gonna make a joke. Terry Basham, Terry Basham. Scrape watch the knees. Scrape it. Terry Basham. There you go. Now it should start raining knees to your thighs. Now we get fake a takedown and come with a strike. So make him think it's another takedown attempt. He brings his hands low. And then answer. And then come over the top. Under yeah, yeah. a minute and a half to go here in round number one. This one's yeah, scheduled for yeah. three. Hakeem Dewadu in the black trunks. Mike Malott oh. in the red trunks. And again, a nice combination from Dewadu. He landed that right hand again. Watch your shot now. It's the Achilles heel from Malott. Malott. Oh. He's going to watch out. Malott comes in and close to his boss, and he's not really protecting that chin too well. He's got to be careful. Wow, he's stuck. Okay, he's in trouble. He is in trouble. DeWatt is now going to tee off. Can he finish him in the final 50 seconds of this one? Yeah, the referee's going to stop this. He's going to stop it. He's going to stop it. Wow. Yeah. We now go inside the cage. Jazz Securo has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee John Brack has seen enough to stop the fight at four minutes and 13 seconds of round number one. Officially a technical knockout due to strikes. Your winner, Mean Hakeem Dewadu! So, Hakeem Duwadu with an impressive performance. Jazz, I would have liked to have seen that fight get into the second round, but again, the right decision was made. But uh, I, I think I think Mike Malott's got some potential. No question, bring him back. Both, yeah, both guys are good. You know, this was just two great strikers against each other. Yeah, something's gonna go wrong. You know, one shot is enough, especially with the power like these guys. And you, where is it? But this is great. I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to both these guys see uh, too much of the fight again. Nice performance by Hakeem Duwadu. And this is really what the future chance is all about. You see guys like this that are starting off with a record of 2-0. Now he runs his record to 3-0. And, and uh, you know, this is where you got to start your career, somewhere like this. That's it. And, you know, it's not bad for Milan because he's got to go back to the drawing board, as they say. He will get better off this if he takes it the correct way, of course. And it will come back stronger. Both of you also. Awesome, man. Awesome.